Jalisco, Mexico, known as the heartland of tequila production, where the blue agave plant thrives in the rich soil and warm climate. But did you know that the history of tequila production dates back centuries to the time of the Aztecs? The Aztecs believed that the agave plant was a gift from the gods and used it for medicinal and ceremonial purposes. They also fermented the agave juice to create a drink called pulque, which was the precursor to modern-day tequila. Today, agave is grown in many different parts of Mexico, each with its own unique soil and climate. From the highlands of Jalisco to the volcanic soils of Oaxaca, each region produces agave with different flavors and characteristics that contribute to the complexity of artisanal tequila. The process of harvesting agave has remained largely unchanged over the centuries. Skilled workers known as hemadores carefully harvest the mature plants by hand using a special tool called a koa. This process requires precision and experience to ensure the best quality piñas are selected for tequila production. Once the piñas are harvested, they are cooked in large ovens to break down the complex sugars and release the flavors that will become the foundation of the tequila. This process, known as roasting, can take up to several days, depending on the distillery and the desired flavor profile. After cooking, the piñas are crushed to extract their juices in a process known as milling. This can be done using traditional stone mills or modern roller mills. Each method has its own unique impact on the final flavor of the tequila. Juice is then transferred to fermentation tanks, where it is combined with yeast to begin the transformation into alcohol. This process takes several days and requires careful temperature control to ensure consistent results. Once the fermentation is complete, the liquid is distilled to separate the alcohol from the water and other impurities. The result is a clear liquid known as tequila blanco, which can be bottled as is or aged to create a more complex flavor profile. For those who prefer an aged tequila, the liquid is transferred to oak barrels for anywhere from two months to several years. This aging process imparts a rich amber color and a smooth, complex flavor. Tequila tastings are a popular way to experience the different flavors and aging styles of tequila. Tasting rooms allow visitors to sample different tequilas side by side and appreciate the subtle nuances of each variety. Tequila cocktails are another popular way to enjoy the spirit. From the classic margarita to the spicy jalapeno margarita, there are endless ways to mix and match the flavors of tequila. But did you know that all tequila is actually a type of mezcal? Mezcal is a spirit made from any type of agave plant, while tequila is specifically made from blue agave and must be produced in certain regions of Mexico to be considered authentic. There are many different types of mezcal, each with its own unique flavor profile. Some are made from wild agave plants and can be quite rare and expensive. Mezcal is traditionally sipped neat, but can also be used in cocktails for a smoky and complex flavor. From the agave fields to the distillery, to the tasting rooms and cocktail bars, the journey of artisanal tequila production is a labor of love, steeped in tradition and culture. And what better way to celebrate this rich heritage than with a classic margarita made with freshly squeezed lime juice, a touch of sweetener, and, of course, a generous pour of tequila. So cheers, or as they say in Mexico, salud. Don't forget to smash the like button, get all up on that subscribe action, and ring the out of the notification bell so you don't miss the next video.